everyone, welcome to a tutorial on how to record Xbox One gameplay without even getting an Elgato capture card or any other kind of capture card at that means. Now, the server requirements, of course, you need Xbox One and you're going to need a computer, at least a semi-decent computer. It could be a good laptop too, but it needs to be able to record gameplay and be able to stream. Now, the reason why I say this, I mean, also, you're going to need Windows 10. Now, if you have Windows 8.1, or Windows 7 at the moment, you can just download it from the site, which will be in the description. And after you're done downloading this, you know, need to download this, OBS. You know, it's really, it's free, it's simple, well, not sort of simple, but I mean, there's many videos on the internet tell you how to set yours up, but I'm gonna give you a little simple rundown of what you need to do. Now, I have two monitors, so that was on my second screen. Let me turn that down. Now, when you get to OBS, this is what you're gonna need to do. You need to add a monitor capture. You know, just add it there. And then we're gonna need to do is go to your settings. And then there's a bunch of encoding stuff, which I can't really tell you what to do because I don't know what kind of computer you're using, but I use my 8000 because it's pretty good, you know, quality of it. And what you're gonna need to do is go to hotkeys. Now, you're gonna need to set a hotkey because most people have a single monitor or, yeah, you're on a laptop, so you're only using a single screen. And you're gonna need to set it to Whatever you feel comfortable, mine's at F9. You can just change it, you can apply, edit it, whatever you want. Now, after you're done with that, you have all this, you have Marta Capture going. All I do is open the Xbox app. Now, this comes with Windows 10 free. You might need to upgrade it from the store, which is pretty easy. I'll just show you how to do it right now. Go here, go to your face, and then you go to the downloads and then check for updates. And so it'll just check for updates. It might take a little while, depending on how fast your internet speed. And I guess I don't have any, so you just go back. All right, now here's the thing, game streaming. It's really good, but depending on your connection. Now, you see me, I have my, my video encoding on level on high, which means, because I have a really good bandwidth in my house and I have a really good computer at the same time, so it gives me high. Now, most people might be recording a medium if you're just using a regular laptop and you know, you probably have a decent connection, you'd be on medium. But I have much on high because I have really good internet and computer. So what you're gonna need to do is go back to home and you see game stream right here. I wanna say stream to Xbox or yeah, stream Xbox PC. And right here, you can see, I think that means microphone's off because I haven't <laughs> used this app too much, but you will need to plug your Xbox controller into your Xbox and Voila, you have Xbox recording. Now, I did just close down my Call of Duty Advanced Warfare for some reason, but you can open it up and then you're able to record everything you see, which is amazing. It's free. It's, you know, before you always have to go out and buy Elgato and then have your laptop next to you or, you know, set up a desk thing. But basically, this is a great way and a free way to record Xbox One gameplay, you know. You can have Skype in the background on your laptop or computer, and OBS will pick up everything, pick up all the voices, and you know, you guys just can go out there and have trolling videos, you can just do random, like, phase, font, you know, montages, and then, you know, it's just really good. It's free, Xbox One, it looks pretty good. You know, it honestly is not the best looking, I can tell you that right now, but it's pretty decent for what you're doing. You know, you're not recording directly from the Xbox, you're recording live streaming from the Xbox. So, I think this is really good. It's pretty free. You know, I'm gonna show you, in a couple seconds, I'm about to show you some gameplay. All right, as you can see, I'm in a game, and you know, it works pretty well. There's just a little bit of stutters here and there because this app is not perfect, you know. Life, I'm guessing game streaming in general, so it's not perfect, but it's really good for what it is. And, you know, you can't really be mad at what you're getting for it. Oh, I died. I'm not very good at Call of Duty at the moment, but yeah, this is pretty good. It's cheap, depending, you know, if you have all the products, but yeah, it's really good. Okay, so remember, links are in the description for Windows 10 and OBS. Uh, leave a comment if this worked for you and now you're happy you record. Uh, leave a like if you enjoy and subscribe if you're not for more videos in the future. I'm Blade Deadshot and I'm out.